at a glance, all appears calm and peaceful, but behind the calmness, there's been a lingering crisis over the kingship stool in Ojoto, a community in Idemili's south local government area of Anambra State. Ojoto is made up of Ojoto Uno and Ojoto Obofia, and the last ruler is from Ojoto Obofia, which means it is the turn of Ojoto Uno to take over leadership. But for over six months, the four villages in Ojoto Uno have been at loggerheads over the traditional stool. Despite the intervention of the state government and through a panel set up to resolve the crisis, the Umo for Kindred went ahead to crown one of their own as king. At this meeting with his people, he makes his position known. We have a constitution under Article 24 1A that stipulates that in any time the distribution of uh, 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 the, uh, positions to the six homeowners we have in Omega, that any time this uh, there, there is a Igwe or councillor or Asato or any other positions that will be communicated to us from the Ojota Kanasa for you know, to provide, to pro uh, produce, that we will do it among the six homeowners on the order of seniority. The panel has concluded its report and the state government has gathered to rulers and other members of the community at the government house, Oka, to present a certificate to the certified traditional ruler. This is the report that was produced. It's 15 pages. The report, it was unanimously adopted by all these wise men in Anambra State, that his excellency set up uh, to look into the Ojoto matter. The arrival of Governor William Biano sets the tone for the day. I'm also very happy about the admonition given to you by the Igbo who is an older Igbo. You know, that this certificate is not a certificate to go and divide Ojoto. This is a certificate to go and unify Ojoto. The new traditional ruler gives the assurance that peace will be sustained in Ojoto. Ojoto will never be a headache to His Excellency again in Anambra State. Yeah. <laughs> we are law abiding and um, we don't disobey government directive. An official king may be certified by the state government, but what is more important is for the community to accept the monarch for peace to reign.